Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to Review Channel. Yes, I am flying the ASC2400 drone. If you saw the unboxing, don't forget to watch that first before you see this. It's really kind of cool. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Let's get to flying this awesome machine. Let's go. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of your Review Channel. And yes, we're doing the actual, uh, we did an unboxing of this really cool little drone. And I'll leave a, a video a link in this uh, description of this video here so you can see the unboxing but we're doing actually we're going to take it open we're going to open it up we're going to fly it so here's the remote control already charged up takes about three or four hours to charge it uh, so it comes fold it comes like this compact really kind of cool and it's a foldable um, also you take out the front ones first you got the front legs first and it's foldable really super easy and we'll go over a couple of things for setup that's that and then we'll fold the bottom ones like this here so just like that so all four so you can see here all fold or unfolded and let's just take a look at the drone so you can see here it has lights in the bottom you can see here it has front lights right here it has a camera that's tiltable okay and it has back lights so you know where the back is you know where the front is you know the orientation at all times when it's flying so that's really super important okay so it has the four lights in the bottom and lights in the front and lights in the back portable design as you can see here so a couple things you have to do so let's talk about here's the remote that I have here um, and it does fit with my iPhone just so you know I did download the mobile app for the actual device itself so you can actually stream on the video so let's put that on here it does fit my phone which is an iPhone 10 Max as you can see here so hopefully you can see that so it does fit which is cool and let's get to the app so you download the app and when you download the app let me get out of here okay you have the app right there so hopefully you can see that you have to do a setup. When you do a setup, you have to hook up to your Wi-Fi system, okay? So just make sure you have a setup with that. But if you want to use it on the field, you have to make sure that you go to your settings. Okay, first thing you have to do is first download the app for the drone. Um, then what happens, you turn the drone on and sends a signal out uh, to the phone and you have to connect to the Wi-Fi signal. It comes and you try to put a password in, but it gives you one back. So that's incorrect. You have to put this one in. So you just copy that one that gives you and put that password in, it connects, you'll see HD drone, it connects right through it to your Wi-Fi system on your phone. Then you open up the app and then you can stream the signal directly into the phone. So that's kind of how that works. So just so you know, hopefully it's clear. Start, okay, and just took a photo, record video. So actually that is the actual picture right now of the drone. So hopefully you can see what I'm doing. So you can actually see, kind of cool. So the picture's okay, I mean, it's okay, it's, it's, um. As you can see here, it's it's a little jittery. So it's 720p in the quality, but um, I don't think it's it's maybe 15 frames a second. 30 is be smoother. Uh, let's see, keep uh, keep Wi-Fi, which is annoying. So that's how that works. You can see that, okay? So we got that set up, and so the camera's all set up. So it's flashing when you first turn on. It does flash, and you have to hit the power for the remote control, okay? So, so hopefully you can see both things here. So you can see this is flashing, and now this is flashing. So two things you have to do to get it set up, okay? You want to sync it. So the way to sync it is up one, down. Now, that is solid red. That means it's connected, you can see that. And that is ready to go. So now the drone is now synced to the remote. What that does is it basically gives you the frequency and the connection so you know. Um, so if you have other people using drones, it'll just, I guess, connect different frequencies with different drones, I'd imagine. I guess that's what that's for, okay? And, and to record video, it's just there's record video and stop record, uh, take photos start and stop recording on the on the software software's kind of cool so check that out i think it's pretty good so i'm just gonna take off in a second so let's resync it up down that's sunk or sunk right synced <laughs> okay that calibrates it okay so to calibrate it is that you put these left and right bound to the bottom center that way you can keep it so it'll get it level so again it does fly all over the place so it's very hard to get it exact um, so I'm just trying to figure this out I'm just trying to show you how this kind of works so you know how to sync it you get that you get that all synced up that's really kind of cool uh, it does have acrobatic, um, acrobatic there's different different tricks and different things like that so I'm gonna try to show you some of that if I can I'm gonna try at least to get it to take off which is kind of cool so let's try to get that going if I can so I do apologize if the video is not perfect but so I'm gonna hold the drone and I'm gonna try to fly at the same time. Hold it, hold it. I'm gonna also do a record. So let's record the video. Hit, re hit record. Take off. And there you go. So the drone's up and running. You can see here, so it's pretty stable. It does drift a little bit and you can do left and right. So I'm showing you back and forth. That's back. 
that's kind of cool you can see and i'm actually hopefully it's recording it's recording so that's kind of cool you can see that so i'm actually just holding it it's actually at my level which is about five feet off the ground so it does drift a little bit so you can you can control it so let's see i'm gonna go forward left and you get about 15 minutes of flight time that's pretty cool right so let's see if i can get it a little higher and let's do a little bit of flying so check it out and get the onboard from the camera to get some of this and i'll just use some of that footage so let's so i'm gonna put this on the ground like that and hopefully you get a little view up there that's kind of cool Yeah, that's pretty sweet. I'm actually near some cows. So hopefully you can get an idea. You can see them right over there. I'm gonna bring it down and get a better angle with the camera. I'll bring this down a little bit. Bring it down. It does drift. And I did try to adjust it a couple different, again, it's a $50 drone. So for 50 bucks, you can't complain. And it works pretty well. And the camera's not bad, actually. It is uh, 720p, so it's not terrible, but it does do a nice job. All right, cool, guys. So what do you think? Tell me uh, what you think. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you're enjoying the video. It is a very cool little drone. It does work well. Let me land it. Again, one touch landing. And you can see there, it does land on its own. All right, guys, I just want to give you some bonus footage here. This is bonus footage, just me flying it around and holding the GoPro, just walking around it and just giving you a, three, a 3D view of, like, what it looks like when it's in the air. And it's just kind of cool. I'm just going all around it with my GoPro and just, it's kind of cool. So uh, enjoy this footage. Don't forget to uh, stay tuned to the rest of the video to the end. Um, and it's really, really, really kind of cool drawing. I really, I really do like it. I do enjoy it. And I do definitely recommend 50 bucks, no question. I'll leave a link down below in the description where you can pick up uh, something similar to this. Uh, great, can't go wrong for the price, and also it does work. It's actually lasted quite a while, actually, so I was very impressed uh, with the time of fly time, and it's really cool. So enjoy this little piece here, and I'll see you at the next review, and I appreciate you tuning in and watching this review uh, on this cool drone. I know you watched the unboxing, and a lot of you did, and you were looking for the finished product, and here it is. So I hope you're enjoying it. really really nicely love it love it love it this works super super cool i really like this drone quite a bit easy to fold easy to take with you in your pocket runs around i don't know maybe 10 12 minutes before it has to be charged you get a couple extra batteries for 50 bucks a great great drone to start out with really really easy foldable portable it works perfect I love it very, very much. Actually, it's a great deal. So I'm going to do some more drone videos. I'm going to get some more stuff. I'm going to get some more cool videos. I'm going to get some newer drones. I'm going to try things out and just really experiment with, with drone flying because I've never done it before. So it seems kind of cool and very, very different. So I do love it. All right, guys, I appreciate it. Hope you learned a little bit about how to take off and how to land. You can see that very easy to sync. Like I said, really super simple. I'll show you one more time. Again, when you first get it, you shut it off. You get the remote off. Okay, again, to sync it, all you do is turn on the drone first, turn on the remote, you go up one, down, and you're synced. So that's all you have to do. Hit the takeoff button, and it takes right off. That's all you have to do. Pretty, pretty easy. Gotta love it. All right, guys, any questions or any comments, leave down below. Again, this is my first time really doing the drone thing. Um, kind of cool. It does fit my GoPro, as you can see here. It does fit my camera, which is really kind of awesome. I uh, appreciate it. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell, and you'll be notified next time I do some cool drone videos. I'm, I'm going to make a channel just for the drones. Um, so I want to link on my channel for just for drone kind of cool stuff. So you go right there. You can see all the drone stuff, all the kind of cool, cool fun kind of drone things. Um, so it's kind of cool. All right, guys, I, I appreciate it. And I'll see you at my next review.